With Chow Chow being one of the biggest events to ever hit Asheville, you just know they're gonna go in and out with a bang. The Mountain Top Soiree opening party is the kickoff event for the Asheville Culinary Festival named Chow Chow. This is Peter Pole. He's the head chef and owner of Posana and the soon to be opening Bargello. Peter, tell us a little bit about that awesome Chow Chow kickoff party. The opening party is an event that's like a pop-up and we're doing it at Highland Brewing Company, which has a great space. It's gonna be a lot of fun. And the big difference here is that the chefs aren't gonna be behind tables. They're gonna be within the crowd, mixing with everybody. And our sous chefs are gonna be preparing the food behind the scenes. Our servers from the restaurants are gonna come out, pass out the food, and the chefs will be able to describe it right to the customer, face to face, talking to people. It's it's gonna be an event not to miss. Well, Peter, that sounds downright groovy, baby. So who are some of these chefs and makers that we'll be able to mingle with? I'm very excited about some of the great participants at the Mountaintop Soiree opening party, um, both local and coming from a distance. And one of them that I'm extremely excited about is someone that actually has roots in Asheville. Her family lives in Asheville, Camille Cogswell from Zahab Restaurant. And Zahab, if you're not familiar with it, is one of the highly rated restaurants in the country. So to have a representative from their, their pastry chef come in and be part of our, our you know, little culinary festival that we're doing here in Asheville. We're so excited for that. And we have some great locals like Devil's Foot Beverage, Brian Canapelli from Kachina, and also Jacob Sessons from Table and All Day Darling. So it's gonna be a lot of fun, a lot of great people there and mingling with everybody and having great food and great drink. It's just gonna be the way to, to kick off our festival. So I know you just heard from Peter about the opening party at Highland Brewing, but let me tell you about what's going to be an incredibly memorable child time closing party at the salvage station. It's going to be a pure celebration of the South. This is Jess Reiser. She's one of the owners of Burial Beer and one of the hosts of the Chow Time Closing Party. Jess, tell them what they can expect in the grand finale of the Chow Chow Fest. On Sunday, September 15th, from 5 to 8 p.m., we're hosting the Chow Time Closing Party at Salvage Station. It's going to be the celebration of the South, food-wise, with barbecue and fried chicken. We're gonna have a lot of local breweries and some cocktails, Burial Beer even brewed a special beer just for Chow Chow that'll be on tap. Um, at the end of the Chow Chow. The name yeah. of the Chow Chow? <laughs> yeah. Fantastic. All right, Jess, you know the drill. Who's going to be there? There are so many amazing vendors at the Chow Time closing party that I would be hard pressed to even name a few. So could you guys show us some, please? Oh. Fine. We'll just do all the work. What I'm talking about. What an incredible list of participants. This is going to be such an amazing party. I really hope to see you there. So please visit chowchowashville.com. Tickets are on sale now. This is really going to be the exclamation mark to a weekend of culminating experiences with Asheville's most innovative and significant culinary festival. Well, guys, there you have it. And whether you're going to the opening party on Thursday the 12th or the closing party on Sunday the 15th, you're sure in for a heck of a good time. Can't decide? Go to both. I'll see you there.